let us solve the question number 3 of exercise 5.4 of chapter 5 and in this question we are given a ladder and the distance between two rungs of this ladder is 25 centimeter and it is also given that the top and the bottom rungs are two and half meter apart like this here and it is also given to us that the rungs decreases uniformly in length from 45 centimeter at the bottom and 25 centimeter at the top. So we have to calculate what is the length of the wood required for the rungs. Let us see how to solve this question. First of all, we have to find out the number of rungs which are used in this ladder. Number of rungs equals to the distance between top and bottom rungs is 250 centimeter because two and a half meter equals to 250 centimeters and distance between two rungs is 25 centimeter plus one rung because we are putting the distance between two, two rungs. So this is 10 plus 1, this is equals to 11. So there are 11 rungs used in this ladder. Now we are given that the rungs decreases uniformly in length from 45 cm at the bottom and 25 cm at the top. This means the length of rungs forms an AP with first term equals to 45 cm and the last term equals to 25 cm. The value of n is 11, so we can calculate the total length of wood required to make these rungs by using the formula Sn equals to n over 2 multiplied by first term plus last term. And what is the value of n? That is 11, so here we can write 11 over 2, A is 45, L is 25, centimeters. So this is equals to 11 over 2 multiplied by 70 centimeters. This means 385 centimeters. So we can write length of the wood required for rungs equals to 385 centimeters. So this is the solution of the question. Thank you.